Hey guys, in this week's breakdown, we're going to take a look at the uh, seven yard touchdown run by Steven Jackson. And I'm actually going to feature Roger Saffold here. It's basically the inside trap. And and uh, when I saw this, I absolutely had to feature this. Um, and I think somebody mentioned in the comments as well that that this was an incredible play. So I went back and looked, and it absolutely was an incredible block. And uh, you're going to see Saffold's right here, and he's basically just going to pull around into the gap, and he's going to take out this linebacker. It, you know, it, it's really, it's nothing fancy, but it's power, um, and it really, really displays uh, Saffold's mean streak. Now, I'm going to let this play a little bit here, and then I'm going to stop it. Okay, now right here he is. He's pulled around, and he's right in here, uh, and he's going to be focusing on this linebacker. Now, you want to see a hit. Check this out. I mean, are you kidding me? I mean, look at that. And he continued to push him out of just out of the picture. Now, here's something else I want you to focus on. What's the one thing the Rams have been lacking? I mean, from from an intangible standpoint, and that's just the the emotion, the raw emotion. I mean, other than Steven Jackson, I mean, we have to give him his due. He has nothing to prove to anybody. But keep an eye on this area of the screen up in here. I want you to take a look at Saffold here. Uh, telling everybody about it, what he just did. Check this out. He knew that it was the key to the play. Check it out. Tell him about it, big fella. You got that right. Um, and that is just unbelievable. Let's take a look at it in full speed again. Wham! I mean, that is incredible. He just stays right after him. Shows the raw emotion at the end. I mean, what what a block. Incredible, incredible block. And uh, that's it for this week's breakdown. Really excited to see us at 3-3. Three and three. Um, really think we got what it takes to take Tampa and Carolina in the next couple weeks. Um, we could very well be five and three at the break. Wouldn't that be something? And uh, I think we're going to kind of need it because we got a tough stretch ahead with Kansas City, uh, Denver, New Orleans. Um, just some real, real tough games coming up. So it'd be really great if we could pull off the next two wins. And uh, we'll see you next week.